Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be doing my March um, favorite beauty products and um, so there are a few beauty products that I've actually used throughout the whole month and the first one that I am in love with for this month that I actually, this is my first, no, my second month using it, like month and a half, and that is Maybelline's Falsies, the Falsies Volume Express, and I am in love with this mascara. I have, I'm going to show you the wand, and this is what the wand looks like. So it has like, it's kind of curved, as you can see, it's just kind of curvy, um, and it really, it doesn't really give any length, I have to curl my eyelashes, but I mean, I think we all do anyways, right, um, and, um, and, but it does not clump up my eyelashes, and let me see if the camera will catch it. I don't think this camera will catch my eyelashes, but they're not clumpy, and um, the way I look right now, I'm sorry, excuse for the way I look, it's just, it's already 10.08, and I'm like almost ready to go to sleep, but I wanted to film this video very quickly. So anyway, so this um, Maybelline's Falsies Mascara is my absolute favorite mascara for this month. I have actually used it for the whole entire, I've actually used it the entire, entire month, every single day. And I think I'm sticking to this one and I think this is like my new all-time favorite mascara. Just because it doesn't clump my eyelashes, it really makes them look a lot more full. Um, and um, so yeah. <laughs> and then I have also for my eyes, I have I've been using this eyeliner for the whole month as well, and this is the Max um, Black Track Fluid Eyeliner, and it just looks like this. So if you can probably see it. Um, I've used a lot of it. I've actually had this um, fluid eyeliner for quite a while. I've had it for maybe about four months I would say maybe three months I would say at the beginning I wasn't wearing it like every single day just because um, I didn't I had to practice wearing fluid eyeliner and so I was just practicing and practicing until I actually kind of somewhat ma somewhat mastered it um, so this is what it looks like and um, brushes I'm still experimenting with brushes um, I'm trying out like different brushes to see which one works for me, what, you know. But I definitely like this fluid eyeliner a lot more than um, the pencil eyeliner. I feel like it stays on for the whole day without just, without it fading away. So I really like that. And then also for my eyes, if um, you haven't checked out my blog, um, I actually posted uh, a post, I posted a post <laughs> um, on uh, my three perfect imperfections. And one of my imperfections was um, just um, my, the circles under my eyes and the puffiness of my eyes. Every time when I'm not wearing makeup, it just looks like I, I cried for hours um, and I have like, especially in the morning, my eyes are like puffy, 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 and it just looks like I haven't slept for days. And so I found this new product. Um, I don't know if it's new. It's new for me, but it's the Garnier Fructis Anti, it's Garnier Fructis Skin Renewal Anti-Puff Eye Roller. And so basically it's just like this, and it has, um, it's like this. And um, you roll it, it has a roller, and you just roll it. I do it every night, religiously. I've been doing it for the last like three weeks, religiously, when I wake up and when I go to sleep. And basically, you just kind of place it on, and then swipe it through. 
and then I do it here and I go down this way as well all the way down and I actually even do it like on the top um, and it feels so soothing and refreshing I do it like right before I go to bed um, I have it right by my nightstand I have it on my nightstand so I just do it and then just close my eyes and go to sleep because it's so refreshing and soothing I absolutely love this stuff and I have seen actually a, not so much a change but I have actually gotten comments about how my eyes aren't as puffy when I wake up or they don't look as um, my circles don't look so dark um, so that was pretty exciting when I got that was pretty exciting when I was told uh, I was like, oh my gosh, that's the Garnier's anti-puff, you know, roller or whatever. So, yeah. And then, um, moving on to lips. Um, I have been loving this product for like, I don't know, months already. And I've actually also worn this almost every day of the, um, the whole month. And I, I also had a blog post on this product on my two all-time favorite lip balms and it is the MAC um, Close for Comfort Tinted Lip Conditioner and it looks like this Let's see, we can, I don't know if the camera will really catch it, sorry um, it just looks like this and it's like a little jar this is what it looks like and I get this at my MAC counter for, I believe it's like $13 with taxes and stuff. And it has no color. It just looks like this. Um, and it's just like a lip balm. I wear this all the time. Um, I put it on before I go to bed, when I wake up before doing my makeup throughout the day this this moisturizer is with me like 24 7 I always have it because sometimes I don't want to add like any lipstick or I'm just quickly on the run and I just pop this out of my little makeup bag and wear it so this is an absolutely must for me along with the birthdays uh, chapstick and this one here is the soothing cooling refreshing thirsty lip balm just looks like that and yeah it's just like this and this is just a mint smell um i also have other birds beads that have like that are tinted that are tinted and i really love those too because they're very moisturizing and they have and they're very pretty like colored um so yeah and so but I really like this one because it's just minty and refreshing and um, and I also wear this when I go when usually I wear this one when I go to like the gym or I exercise or anything like that because this will stay on for a longer period of time and then I have two more and then I have two more beauty products um, and these are MAC products lip products and this one here is Max um, Dream Gaze, and I actually got this in a set of three. Oops, wait, <laughs> this way. I don't think the camera is really can to catch this, but it's just Dream Gaze, and I'm sure you've all seen it. If not, you can go online and look at it. And look how dented it is. That's how much I've used it, and that's like the very tip. So I've been using this color like every single day um, just because lately it's been getting warmer and I just feel like I've been wearing a lot of burgundies and reds and stuff like that so I really wanted to try. I've been using this like all the time and you know what I really love the way this one smells for some reason I really like the way it smells and then along with that I wear my uh, lipstick days in the color days along with my um, MAC Dazzle Glass and Baby Sparks. Um, and I am in love with this Dazzle Glass. Um, it's just pink, and if you can see, 
I have used a very significant amount. Almost the whole half of the bottle is gone in like a matter of like two months. But this month I've been wearing it a lot more. This is what it looks like. It just has like a little brush. If you don't know, MAC Dazzle Glass. Um, and it's, and I also love the way this one smells. And it just has like blue undertones. It has a lot of glitter, so it just looks very, very glittery. Very, very glittery. <laughs> okay, anyways, and I actually got these two in a little pouch, makeup pouch like this. This is the makeup pouch I got it with and it was like this really cute MAC handle thing. And it came along with um, Dervish, the lip liner. Dervish looks like this, oops. <laughs> and um, it's just a lip liner, but I haven't been wearing the lip liner as much. Um, I don't know, I'm not like a lip liner kind of person, so I haven't been used, I've used it a few times, and I still love it, it's a very pretty color. But anyways, um, okay, so those are my favorite um, March beauty products, I hope you enjoyed it, and hope you come back for more videos, I have a lot more to come, and um, don't forget to subscribe, check out my blog, I'm going to post it down below, and um, that's it, <laughs> thank you, bye.